We live in a world nowadays where cameras are everywhere. I mean, heck, we carry cameras with us on the daily, our cell phones, and they have good quality cameras too. Now, if you're a YouTuber, a YouTuber vlogger, you have a camera with you 24-7. Now, imagine how easy it is to buy inconspicuous cameras, cameras you could hide. And we used to think that these type of cameras were only in movies, like James Bond, spy cameras. Now, we could just go and buy them with just a click of a button. Amazon, Wish, and I think you even get a micro camera from the little spy gear toy sets that they sell at Walmart. Now these cameras can be hidden anywhere. Well some Airbnb guests were victims to two hidden secret cameras inside their Airbnb. Airbnb is tackling privacy concerns this morning after several customers found hidden cameras at their rental properties. The company told CBS News it takes privacy extremely seriously and there is absolutely no place in our community for this kind of behavior. An Airbnb, if you don't know what it is, is like a rent for the night or rent for the week or month. It's where people can rent out their properties, loan out a spare room to strangers and they get paid for it by the company Airbnb. The people that run the Airbnb company have a strict privacy policy for the clients that rent out their homes and their properties. If you're a guest staying at Airbnb, the owner of the property has to inform the guest that there are cameras on the property and no cameras should be allowed in the bathrooms or the bedrooms to keep things secret and private. Well, this wasn't the case for Megan Hilden and her friends that rented out an Airbnb when they found a hidden camera watching them in the bathroom. 22-year-old Megan Hilden from Washington State was in Switzerland in 2016 when she says a friend discovered a cell phone under the sink in the bathroom at their Airbnb. I was like, this could be like the day that I get killed or we saw that the phone was filming and we were whispering and trying to be very quiet. We weren't sure if it was being live streamed. Soon after, Hilden says they found an iPad also recording. They quickly left and reported the incident to the company. How twisted and demented do you have to be to hide a cell phone in the bathroom to record people? What makes this even worse, scarier, and creepy is that the footage could have been shared with somebody or live streamed and probably sold on the dark web. We don't know. I don't even want to think about if this happened to other people or what the footage was actually used for. It's around 2 million people use Airbnb on any given night. I've talked about a dead body being found in a water tank at a hotel in the channel before. But now I want to talk about hidden cameras inside your hotel rooms. Look at this hotel manager right here. He is supposed to be doing a maintenance in the bathroom, supposedly, but instead he's hiding a hidden camera aiming directly towards the shower. This hotel manager in Florida is pretending to make repairs in the bathroom of a room occupied by two young women. What he's really doing is setting up a hidden camera and look where it's pointing, directly into the shower. Spying on his guests, taking showers. Now this ain't the only hotel that's actually experienced this. At another Florida hotel, this manager placed a hidden camera in a floor vent in a bathroom. In Virginia Beach at a local hotel, Nights and Suites, a family of three found a hidden camera pointed directly at the shower and the sink. A clear view of everything that's going on. This family says they found a hidden camera in their hotel room. Angela Wallace, her husband and 11-year-old daughter, found a camera like this in the bathroom pointed at the shower. We tried to get some answers. I'm Lisa Guerrero with Inside Edition. Nope. And there's a family here that found a hidden camera in the bathroom over Memorial Day weekend. How could something like this happen? The manager walked away. It wasn't here when that happened. OK, but do you know who did it? Was it an inside job? Hotel rooms are a perfect spot to hide cameras. You can hide them anywhere in the room and go unnoticed. This is what makes it more scary. You should always be aware or always go into a room thinking you're being recorded until you find it secure enough that you're not being recorded. Check every inch of that hotel room before you stop and relax. Now this last one I want to talk about is about a high school volleyball coach who secretly recorded one of his volleyball players as she was changing in the locker room. 16-year-old Jessica spotted her volleyball coach secretly recording her with his cell phone after practice. I was terrified. This 16-year-old says she caught the girls' volleyball coach secretly videotaping her. I went into the locker room and I was changing by my locker and I looked up and I saw a camera. 
Honestly, I don't believe a male should be a coach for a female team. I believe a female should be a coach for a female team. I mean, you don't see any females being coaches for male teams. Only female coaches for females and male coaches for males. That's it. I mean, yes, you have these psychotic female teachers who record their female players. That's very rare. Worst part about this, we don't even know how long this coach has been recording his players. Days, months, years, who knows? It's a shocking invasion of privacy. Imagine getting undressed in a locker room and spotting a camera like this one pointed right at you. Now, the name of this coach is Raymond Van Sickle who is being charged with possession of child pornography and unauthorized recording of a minor. He's pled not guilty. Sir, do you normally tape young girls in locker rooms? He was tight-lipped when we tried to speak to him on his way out of court. Are you just a locker room pervert? Now, I know schools have cameras all over them. Some schools are even trying to implement cameras in the bathrooms. But how sad is it that at schools, you have to be hyper-vigilant on what's going on in the bathrooms? what's going on in locker rooms. Being scared that your coaches or teachers or other students are secretly recording you without even knowing. Remember, assume you're always being recorded. Until the next video, peace guys.